Well, good morning, everybody. Uh, it's a slightly blustery day here at Lapa Valley today, but we're uh, here to take a look at our 10 and a quarter inch gauge 060 diesel locomotive, Eric. So myself and a colleague are here just running a couple of our engines, making sure they're working. Um, we have brought Eric down from the shed this morning, so all the fluids have been checked and uh, things have been had a once over. But I hope you enjoy our little tour to show you a bit more of it. depth look at Eric our uh, ten and a quarter inch gauge 060 diesel locomotive built by Alan Keith on Ross and Y we'll start with the obvious black cap here now this is to top up the radiator water and the radiator water provides the cooling for the engine we're using red coolant on this particular engine Let's reattach that one there there we go. And as we move slightly back, you can see an air intake there. And we can also see on this side the diesel filler cap. So that one is the exhaust pipe. And around this side, we have a filler cap for the hydraulic oil. Now this locomotive is a diesel hydraulic Unlike some of the other locomotives you will come across, which are diesel electric, this one relies on hydraulics to make her drive. So just walking around now, pop the key in there. We'll take this little key here and let you have a little look at the engine where all the magic happens. So inside we have a three cylinder Perkins diesel engine and that uh, three cylinder diesel engine provides the power to the hydraulic pump which is at the back of the engine and then that is chain driven onto the wheels and the wheels are linked by the coupling rods just down there and as we just move around a little bit further take this cover off And here you can see the electric air compressor. Down here we've got a series of relays and electrical switches and we've also got the master switch there for the air compressor and the locomotive's horn just there. So we'll replace these covers. So now we shall start the locomotive. So before you start Eric, we need to make sure that she is in neutral, which is the middle there. Turn the key, you see the lights come on, and then over. A little bit lethargic. You can hear the three cylinder Perkins diesel roar into life. So the cab controls are relatively simple. We've got the directional switch just here. We've got some lights, which are front and back. We've got the horn just here. And over here, we've got the air brakes for the carriages. And we've got the engine's power handle, the throttle. And lastly, down here, we've got the handbrake. Well, I hope you've enjoyed that little tour of Eric. and. Uh, when we're able to reopen, we look forward to seeing you again soon.